Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. It's time. It's reveal time for the last time, at least for me. Um, I got to reveal one of the very first cards when they let the content creators reveal the cards. And uh, I'm very, very grateful to be able to bring to you one of the last went cards. Uh, monster card. I hope you guys are all excited. Um, I'm, I'm glad they're they're buffing up this this archetype as you can tell on the side of the screen here we're going with some vampires so it's a vampire card um I'm uh I I've always liked this archetype I just um it, it it's always been very slow it's 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 a it's a fun archetype I enjoy it it's just it it's really slow so I'm hoping this card uh, can give it uh, the oomph that it needs so that uh, you know you can uh, run those fletters and unseen elders and detlofs and let them just go bananas and orianas um, so grateful so very grateful um, let's jump into it we and then uh, we're gonna have some mushy stuff at the end since uh, this is gonna be our last reveal uh, for the Gwent, uh, Gwent cards, so, um, here we go, um, it's, like I said, it's a vampire, it's a legendary, stick strength, 10 provisions, and her name is Verena, Verena is vampire deploy, give an enemy unit bleeding four. So it's getting its provisions off the bat uh, as long as everything isn't purified. And its effect is bleeding units cannot be bo boosted. So that includes your own units, uh, FYI. So in the mirror, if you got both of these down, <laughs> nobody's getting anything on the boosted units. Um, you know, you're, you're probably going to want to position this behind a defender or get it boosted up. Uh, it is prone to locks. But, uh, you know, you can run the, um, the Purify with it, which is nice. Um, I mean, you got to remember that um, in these other matchups, when if this is on the board and you put bleeding on certain things that are like engines that boost, they can't boost as long as this thing's alive. <laughs> so you're getting, you're, you're taking away damage from them with all the bleeding that you could put down. And then they can't boost the units that are bleeding. So you sit this behind a defender or they can't answer it. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Like I said, Queen of the Night, you can uh, purify it uh, if it does get locked. If it gets removed, I mean, that's that's went in general, you know, removal is removal. But um, just think about all the bleeds you get down and opponents trying to keep their engines alive by boosting them. And now they can't because Verena is on the board. How crazy is that? That's crazy. I absolutely love it. Fantastic art. Um, she kind of looks like X-23 from X-Men. Uh, <laughs> Wolverine's, I believe it's 23. Um, it's like X-23 meets the ring girl. <laughs> I love it. Fantastic art. Carol uh, Bem always does a fantastic job with the art. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the reveal. Um, like I said, since this is our last card reveal, you know, I just wanted to say a couple things, you know, that. Um, so I, you, you hear me say it all the time that I'm so very grateful and thankful for cdpr and the gwent community um never in a million years would i have thought you know that i would you know be able to record videos and people just watch them <laughs> it just it um I, I, it, it, not on this scale you know i know i'm not one of the biggest content creators or whatever but it just the amount of people that i've been able to meet and you know just friends that I've made, you know, basically all over the world is, is mind blowing. Just, just from a, a card game, a simple card game that I've just 
I've just met and I, I'm the experiences I've had and everything. I'm just so very grateful. I, I just can't express it enough, you know, and I know that people, you know, you see it, whether it's in cyberpunk or the Witcher or even Gwent, you know, when something seems to go wrong, these communities always band together and, you know, stick up for the company that just always seems to have the the little guy in mind, whether it's the rejects, the the rebels, the unwanted, you know, it's just they they're always looking out for those type of people and that's why I think they all they will always be the people's champ of developers when it comes to video games. And after, you know, getting to hang out with a lot of them and just seeing how they operate and what they do and being in their offices and everything. It's just, you could just see how much passion they put into the games that everybody plays. And I'm just so grateful that uh, they do what they do. And there's a company like that that's looking out for people like me and you i just think it's fantastic uh cdpr family and i'm so grateful to be part of it thank you guys so much and get ready for more reveals this week i'm so excited you're all wonderful thank you